Good afternoon and welcome to the TPM 4 Minute Friday where we show you tips and techniques that will help your everyday tasks. My name is Dana Rice and I'm the Civil 3D and Infrastructure Application Engineer and today I will be showing you how to run a cut fill analysis in InfraWorks 360. I have InfraWorks 360 open as you can see and before we begin I have to show you uh, on the opening screen over here on the right uh, under preview you have five uh, analysis modules before we can perform a cut fill analysis and assign grading to a land area you have to be sure to activate the land areas and grading behaviors uh, module I agree hit close okay so we're good to go so now I'm gonna go ahead and get into my 3D model of Edgewood Maryland as you can see here I have a land area already created but let me show you where this command is. It's under the orange module and it is right here, land areas. That's been created. If I right click and go to properties for this land area, it brings up the properties dialog box. I can go over here to rule grading. One of the things you can do with the land area is you can assign a grading style to it. I'm going to assign this 3 to 1 cut, 5 to 1 fill. Come up here and hit update. And so what we're doing in InfraWorks 360 is we are doing a preliminary cut fill analysis on your site. So in other words, during the preliminary stage of your project, you can do a cut fill analysis that will give you the same numbers as it would in Civil 3D and it is a lot more uh, time saving okay so the 3 to 1 cut 5 to 1 fill has been assigned to this land area I'm now going to uh, go to the analyze your model and come down here to the terrain statistics command and when I select that it changes your crosshair to a little plus sign and you can see it gives you a red uh, area that you would select and in the interest of time I'm being uh, very liberal with this. I'm not really squeezing in as tight to the green area as I normally would. But there you go. Uh, the cut fill numbers, it gives you your 2D area, volume cut, volume fill, volume net. And so just that quickly you can get your cut fill analysis in InfraWorks 360 and it is just as accurate as if you are in Civil 3D. Well thank you for spending a bit of your time with TPM and our 4 Minute Friday. My name is Dana Rice and I hope this helped you out tremendously.